Hi, welcome to Lakeshore RV Center. I've got your new 2022 Cougar Half Ton 25 RES fifth wheel. Let's take a look around your beautiful new camper. Up front, you've got a molded fiberglass front cap with LED lights built in, a mirror to look down into the bed of the truck to hook up your Trail Air Rotaflex pin box that'll take away some of the herky jerky towing it down the road. Up front in the storage bay, you're gonna have your spare tire, sewer hose, electrical adapters, uh, access to the batteries, and right there is a quick battery disconnect that will shut off uh, some of the drain on the batteries. No worries though, it's gonna load up nice and fast with that 200 watt solar system. LED docking lights are going to be right here. That's those pretty LEDs on the front cap. You have two slide outs on your Cougar half ton. You have ring gutters to help take water away from the side of the camper, keeping it looking nice. Two 30 pound propane tanks are all filled up for you. You're gonna have a little valve right in here to be able to switch which tank is being drawn from. Nice big pass through storage with your 50 amp service cable. You have a 15 amp controller for your solar. And down low, you're gonna have the control panel for Lippert's auto leveling system. Inside the storage bay, you also have a little reminder sheet on how to operate that. We'll go ahead and include a video on troubleshooting the auto leveling as well as operating it. You're gonna have your command station with everything in it to hook up to your utilities. We've got hot and cold water shower, water bypa or bypass for your water heater, excuse me, winterization system, uh, spots to plug in your fresh water supply, and a black tank sewage flush gray and black pull valves to empty those tanks. Access to the key TV system for cable and satellite. I'll send you an additional video explaining that in more depth. And then also a quick connect for a portable solar panel if you choose to add that on. Down below there is a little uh, compartment opening to be able to bring those utilities up and in and connect them. Access to your water heater that is both gas and electric. Hook up for your 50 amp services along the back and you also have an access panel to fill in your fresh water holding tank. Down low here is going to be the spot you're going to hook up your sewer hose to be able to drain both the gray and the black tanks. Along the back, you're gonna have your two inch receiver hitch and a four way flat wiring harness for tandem towing if you choose to do so. An additional hot and cold water shower outside. Prepped and ready for a backup camera or observation camera. Ladder to access the roof for keeping it clean and beautiful. Little outside kitchen here, we're gonna have a grill for you. Fridge. And a nice big power awning with LED lights to sit and enjoy that kitchen with. And again, access to your pass-through storage. Marine grade speakers are installed. And you do have magnets holding your slam latch doors up in a way. Let's take a look inside your camper up these solid lipper steps. In the kitchen here, tons of storage, and we've got the keys to your new castle. You're gonna have a 30 amp Furion microwave, hood fan and lighting, and they do this cool glass top cover on your three burner cooktop. Flip it over once and one more time, and make a nice little backsplash and give you access to your burners. Big huge oven underneath. 12 volt on your Norco refrigerator is 10 cubic feet and that will draw from your battery that is powered by the onboard solar. Some great huge storage on this corner where your entertainment center, CD, DVD player, Bluetooth, and your electric fireplace is putting out some heat right now. Trifold sleeper sofa, 
and your booth seating. You're also prepped and ready for Wi-Fi for the WineGuard router. Send you some information on that as well. AC is ducked all through the ceiling and the heating is ducked all through the flooring. And on your booth, you will have some great storage underneath. And to keep it nice, we have a dimmer switch for the lighting above your dinette and your high to bed sofa. And upstairs. You have a huge shower with a three panel glass door. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and keep this secured when you're traveling down the road. So you're going to bring all the panels over and latch. That way you keep having a nice three panel shower door. Great linen storage. And a porcelain foot flush toilet. Queen bedroom up front, prepped and ready for a second AC if you ever choose to install one. And wardrobe slide out. Everybody asks, what's this little thing? That's going to tell the in-command system the temperature of the room to help control that heating and cooling settings. And that in-command is going to be right here. I've got a great video explaining more on this and where to download the app for your phone. Right now your security password is going to be a bunch of zeros that will allow you to go in and access your slide outs, your awnings, different settings to control the password, turning on master interior lighting, the water pump and water heater. Havac is going to have the front AC as optional, so you can well, try that one more time. <laughs> Hit the wrong little arrow. There we go. And rear AC right now is in heat mode. You can tap through that and get it to AC, and that will allow you to control it. You have start and stop options. All kinds of ways of customizing your use on your new Cougar. And that right there is your new 25 RES Cougar Half Ton Fifth Wheel. If you have any questions, give us a call at Lakeshore RV Center. Ask for Steve, our Cougar Specialist, and he will help you out.